Welcome. This is chapter 11 of The Spiritual Combat and a Treatise on Peace of Soul by Dom Lorenzo Scupoli. The title of this chapter is Some Considerations Which Will Incline the Will to Seek Only What is Pleasing to God. In order to incline our will to fulfill exactly the will of God and to promote His glory, let us remember that he has set the example by loving and honoring us in a thousand different ways. He created us out of nothing, after his own likeness, and he subordinated all of the things to our use. If our redemption he passed by the most brilliant angel to choose his only son, who paid the price of the world, not with perishable gold or silver, but with his sacred blood in a death as cruel as it was wretched. He continually guards us from the fury of our enemies. He fights for us with his grace. And to nourish and strengthen us, he is always ready to feed us with the precious body of his Son in the sacrament of the altar. Not these constitute convincing proofs of God's tremendous love for us? Who can understand the immensity of his love for such wretched creatures? What should be our gratitude towards such a generous benefactor? If the great men of the world think they are obliged to do something in return for the respect paid them, even by those inferior as to position and wealth, what return ought not the very worms of the earth make when honored with such remarkable love and esteem by the sovereign Lord of the universe? In particular, we must never forget that His Majesty is infinitely worthy of our service, a service motivated by a single principle of love, whose only object is His will and desire. And so concludes chapter 11 of The Spiritual Combat and a Treatise on Peace of Soul by Dom Lorenzo Scupoli.